arrived. Hi, this is Joel Nuss. And I'm Erin Marie. And this is The Look. Hey! So today I'll be showing you guys Jello's glam makeup that I did on her for her birthday. Happy birthday, Jello! Thank you! <laughs> Hope you like the look, but if you guys want to see how it went through, keep on watching. So we already started with her foundation. It's the Hourglass Vanish Seamless Finish Liquid Foundation. Damn, that's a long name. <laughs> but she's in the shade Bisque. <laughs> so we already applied that on her face, but I'm gonna go in and like kind of buff it out. You know, just show everything is nice and even. Are your eyebrows microbladed? Um, they're or tattooed. Puffed? Oh yeah, okay. That's good, that's worked for me. <laughs> <laughs> but you can uh, go over with this. Yeah, okay. It's officially 100% healed. Oh, okay. Yes. Bless. Bless. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that is done. Now I'm gonna snatch her face here using this MAC, this new palette that I got. It's the MAC Pro Palette Full Coverage Foundation with 12 different colors. And we're just going to make a shade for her contour. Hmm. What color? <laughs> Actually, I use like any color. Oh, really? I just like, yeah, 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 just tap into all of them. <laughs> just tap into all of them. Yeah. Because it kind of just blends out when you use them all. So how does it feel like to be 23 now? 23 is a weird age. That's it's true. like you are an adult, but... I think it's just another year, being 20. Yeah. Like mid-early. You know, just, you know, adulting for another year. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you have any goals in mind for mm. this year? Or... Get my driver license. <laughs> <laughs> True, same. <laughs> what made you decide to dye your hair again? <laughs> dye my hair. It was fading out actually. Oh. It was like brown before, right? Ish. Or yeah, it was blue. like a faded out to a brown ash. Uh -huh. Ash brown ish. Uh -huh. I was like, mm, let's play with the dark colors. Uh -huh. I normally like to. Um, Experiment. You normally like to experiment with the colors? Oh my soul. Mm -hmm. I mean, if it goes to violet or blue, it's all me. <laughs> and I'm all my client. Yeah. Kind of gonna use this one. This is supposed to be for brows, but Ooh, I'm just what using happened? It. I know. Oh shit. No it's one needs destroyed. to see that. No one needs to see Are that. You sure? But yeah. <laughs> show them, show them. Oh my god. It's so dirty. But I only use like the like browns in here. Like it's supposed to be a brow palette, but I actually use the browns now Damn. for contour because it's still more on the ashy gray side so how did the black this. get into that i know how? this is like powder i don't know it just flaked so this product i wouldn't really recommend anymore <laughs> anymore <laughs> to anymore to people yeah so i'm gonna use this one to snatch the face snatch me <laughs> okay can you do the face thank you you know bless contour Without contour, I'm a big blob. Yeah. A white blob. Everyone's gonna just be round. <laughs> round. round. <laughs> Do you usually like pat, uh, pat in your foundation or more like? Uh, apparently, okay, when I bought this foundation at mm -hmm. Sephora, the person that explained to me, like she did on my face, she's mm -hmm. like, you can pat it to be a concealer, mm -hmm. but you can like buff, buff it, it in it. as a foundation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what I've noticed. And do you usually use like a brush or do you use a sponge? I use a brush. Mm. I mean, I got like holes in my face. Okay. Look at that! <laughs> texture. Texture. I mean, my face is like the moon. Ah! <laughs> you put a moon emoji. <laughs> Scorpio season. It's Scorpio season. Scorpio season. <laughs> So Scorpio like being season. a sort Scorpio. What is it like? They say. Hmm. They, say. <laughs> they say. And do you agree? Please. Actually, yeah. They say that Scorpios are emotional, and they hold a lot of secrets. What else? They're fun. Well, like they say they're more extroverted, but I feel like every year as you grow older, when I grow older, <laughs> I get more introverted. Mm, makes sense. It's kind of weird, but I'm more introverted every year. <laughs> We're also the... What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Say it again. Say it. Yeah. Oh, 
We're apparently. Not, apparently, we're like the sex symbol <laughs> of the sign. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it says. Just saying. Wait, is Scorpio like a water sign too, right? Yeah, it's a yeah. water sign. Yeah, I'm a Cancer, so we're also quite emotional too. But more like sensitive and like yeah, crybaby sensitive, yeah. But I feel like, tell me if this is true, but like, are Scorpios more like <laughs> emotional in like aggressive way? Yeah, we can get really scary. Scary. <laughs> like, you don't want to fuck with a yeah, Scorpio. Yeah, yeah, Because like, if you fuck with a Scorpio, mm, you're going to get hell. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, comment down below if you believe in like horoscopes and stuff, we want to know. <laughs> some, some of that stuff is funny. Nose contour. Yes. Snatch it up. Yep. Eyes. Face. And nose. Good for now. What a difference. <laughs> <laughs> so there's a mirror behind this yeah. camera. And you can see. Like we, we can see, see ourselves. Yeah. What's happening? I can see from far that I'm not a big vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Splash time. I'm going to go in with these. BH Cosmetics nude blush colors. Probably gonna go more of a peachy type thing. Let's do it. Let's do this one. Some people actually skip this step. Right? Yeah. Do you usually skip blush? No. Yeah, <laughs> no. <laughs> Give life back to me. <laughs> I used to be that one person who like only wore yeah contour or like bronzer. And then like I find that like now that I wear a blush, yeah, it does really help bring that youthfulness back into the skin. <laughs> <laughs> not on the apples of the cheeks because we're not going for like a rosy cheek doll. Type. Yeah, doll look. We're gonna go for Abaga. <laughs> Abaga. ABG. ABG look. Oh, fry time. Fry time. <laughs> I just realized you have a mini fan brush. Yeah. It's like normally you see like the big ones. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, some or makeup artists use that for mascara actually, but I find that it's a really nice like even for um blood or not blush for highlight is really good because really precise and really like yeah. <laughs> Last time Erin did my makeup, almost fell asleep. Really? Like, oh the God. neon liner, right? Yeah. Check that video out. We're gonna put it I there. <laughs> Link down below yeah. in the description. Yeah. That's done. Okay, we're gonna go for the actual middle part of her <laughs> middle part of her <laughs> So starting with the eyebrows here. Would you say having your eyebrows tattooed does save you time in the morning? Oh yeah, it takes 15 minutes. I know, even in my own routine, it's, for my eyebrows it takes like 10, 15 Yeah, minutes. just on itself. Mm -hmm. Normally I would use like the Anastasia pomade mm -hmm. gel. It really stays. Mm -hmm. Like I try to cheap out. And I bought the e.l.f. brand. Mm -hmm. I'm like, oh wow, what a difference. Is it the same thing though? Or is it not as good? It'll be good for like a couple of uses on the e.l.f. Yeah. But then after that, it just gets really crumbly and oh. really thick. So it kind of really just... It. Even if you have like a really good brush, like eyebrow brush, mm -hmm. on the e.l.f. pomade, it's just really gross. Oh, not the same, but it's not going to be the same as like Anastasia. Yeah. A little better. So I'm going to carve out the eyebrows using... More of the foundation. Is this thing working? Get out. Wow. I actually forgot the stuff. Oh. Uh, you don't need it even. Yeah. Just for the extra. Snatcheroony. Snatcheroony. <laughs> 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 Shadow primer. I'm gonna be using the Urban Decay one. Pretty well known, pretty famous. So we're gonna be using tape for Jello. So the eye shadows are gonna look on fleek. Done. Done. That's the finished look. Um, hope you guys enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm gonna be grabbing typical eyeshadow brush and then just put a wash of this beige color here from the Lorac palette. Number two. <laughs> Back to video mode. <laughs> so I'm gonna go now that the crease is done, I'm actually 
actually gonna build one more color on top of it. I'm gonna go for like an orangey kind of color. It's not gonna be too overpowering, so I'm just gonna go over just for the extra dimension. So I'm getting this clay color, it's like a terracotta color, onto her outer eye. I'm just buffing it in as the base color for her smoky look. Now I'm gonna pick up a black and we're just gonna do right at the outer corner here. Just so the when I put the eyeliner, it's gonna really blend into it. Oh, so it's okay. I'm <laughs> oh, in your space. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, so the black is done. I'm gonna go into the Stila Kitten Karma glitter. Glitter and glow liquid eyeshadow. And I'm just gonna apply this all over her eyelid here, just the inner part. There's some fallout, but it's okay, we'll fix it. Two. <laughs> I'm gonna be using the Lise Watier Dramatique Intense 3D Volume Mascara. Look down, actually. Or don't close it, but just look down. Yeah. Whoa, look how fluffy these are. Where did you got them? Where did you get them from again? AliExpress. <laughs> okay, so we just finished the lashes, and I'm. I'm gonna just buff every piece of glitter off because they're all over the place. <laughs> it's okay, it's my birthday. Give me all the glitter. glitter yeah. <laughs> so, highlight. We're gonna be using the. Oh. <laughs> so, we're gonna use the Hyper Real Glow from MAC, the pink glitter palette here. I'm just gonna be using all the colors mixed together and then highlighting her face. For lips, what do you have? Do you have anything that you're gonna use tonight? Ooh! Oh, it's right behind you! <laughs> it's like so a L'Oreal 306 Scarlet Concer Concerto. What a fancy name. Oh, it's a gloss. Ooh! That's a red. That's a true red. Mm -hmm. Let's take a look. Should I line the lips first? Are you gonna just do. Okay, of course. Of course, of course. Thank you. Of course! So we're gonna be using this lip pencil. Called Voltage Rouge. Ooh, Voltage, Voltage Rouge. Surge <laughs> of red. Electrifying. Yes. Prep and Prime Fix Plus. All over. <laughs> the face was fine, but once it, once it hit the chest, I was like, oh, sorry, oh. sorry, sorry. <laughs> oh, it's cold. <laughs> it's a cold. It's a cold. <laughs> it's a cold. I'm actually so excited for you. You're gonna have some fun. And then the all nighter. Two, three. We're gonna do two layers of that. <laughs> <laughs> she knows. Yeah. <laughs> she knows. Three, two, one. On the sides, for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, oh god, wait. Please. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Should we contour my chest too? Like, mm -hmm. Oh yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, after. Oh. That's a good idea, actually. How would I? How would you like it? <laughs> Right here and uh, <laughs> define those. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll look orange first. Don't worry, no. <laughs> Ain't worried. Trust. Trust the process. <laughs> Finish look. 
look. Smoky eyes with a red lip, perfect for Jello's birthday. How do you like the look? Glamified. <laughs> So if you guys like the look, feel free to like, like share, and subscribe. Hey, Now put on the glasses, girl. Show them. Let's see. Crash your birthday. Crash your own birthday. Oh, crash your own birthday. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh.